Hello, this is Philip Myers of Pemi Consulting. This safety moment is about a horrible release of chlorine that occurred yesterday in Aqaba, Jordan. This vessel was dropped during a crane operation where a 25-ton cylinder or pressure vessel storing the liquid chlorine was loaded onto the ship deck. This map shows where Aqaba is located in Jordan. It's a beautiful place. I was fortunate to have visited this area once in my lifetime are dead tonight after a massive explosion and toxic gas leak at a Jordanian port. According to the Jordanian government, a crane was loading chlorine tanks onto a ship when one of them was dropped as a result of a crane malfunction. Video independently verified by NBC News shows the moment a cloud of yellow gas spread to cover the dock, sending workers running for their lives. Chlorine is one of the top chemicals produced because it is so useful. It is used as a disinfectant in water supplies and in swimming pools. It's a pale greenish yellow gas, but for commercial purposes, it is compressed and held in vessels as a liquid at about 55 PSI. Let's give you a few facts about chlorine. While chlorine is not flammable in air, it is extremely reactive. In fact, when it contacts water, such as in human tissue, it strips out the oxygen from the water and creates hypochlorous acid and hydrochloric acid. Here are some facts about chlorine and its toxicity. This program provided research results on dispersion of both chlorine and ammonia gases. You can Google the Jackrabbit program to get more information. But I want to show you a few clips next from a release of chlorine that is straight down at the ground and one that is straight up vertically. The chlorine liquid is instantly flashing and the vapor is quickly being generated. The size of the vehicles gives you a sense for the rate at which the vapor cloud grows. It looks to be much faster than you could run to the right, but running laterally might help you get to a safe area. Also notice the vapor cloud is not much above the tops of the vehicles, so that might be a safe area. This trial shows what happens in a vertical up release. So the tank car is just about released its total contents. Unfortunately, chlorine releases are not all that uncommon. They occur on a regular basis. If you work around or near chlorine, there are many good resources about how to protect yourself on the CDC website, on the Chlorine Institute website, and other locations. Thank you.